Yeah, what it is, what's happening, what's going. Everybody, it's your boy Mike Rich, man. I hope everybody, each and every last one of y'all, is having a blessed day today. Today, I have to see for myself. Anytime something is happening in the sneaker community that I could possibly go see hands on, I have to see for myself. I have to find out. Even if the vibes might be trash or if the vibes might be unsuccessful, I still have to go lay my eyes upon the situation. So that's what this video is about. Air Jordan 3's and Ross. Let's see if it's real. Do it. So I'm not sure how this is gonna go. If they don't have nothing in here, it's a possibility. Well, if they don't have those threes, I probably won't post this video because I just did a Ross uh, vlog not too long ago. So, we're going to see what they got. These folks close at midnight. It must be like a holiday thing because they actually close at midnight tonight. Friend, like I said, from what I've been seeing online, they've been having mostly big sizes like 18 and 19 and stuff like that. Can't do nothing with that. But, um... It's been a couple of them that said they had like a like size 11 and up. And if I get a 12 for like, I think it was like 80 something dollars they said, I'm doubling up. I'm not seeing it though. <laughs> this vlog might not go up, Shardy, because I ain't seeing, I'm definitely not seeing no joy. Oh, 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 oh. They're huge though. Oh my God, they so big. Yeah, these are the only ones they got, Shardy. Good God, I just need a 12. I'm gonna ask them still if they got any in the back. I doubt it. But $84.99, this is a size 17, I think. Yeah, a men's size 17. At bed, stomples, you feel <laughs> Clump, clump, clump. Oh, see, I ain't even do nothing. Y'all gonna embarrass me like that in here? And that's this shoe that's ringing. I ain't even touched that one. And this one right here is a size 17 as well. So they got two size 17s in here. Ant bed stomper clump clump action for $85. Anyway, I had to grab both of them to do my thumbnails. <laughs> they look pretty. I mean, they. I don't see nothing, no B grade. Nothing wrong with them. They look pretty consistent with the pairs I got at home. If they had a uh, size 12, I would have definitely doubled up on these. But these are just way too huge i even asked the guy he said they did have other sizes but they went fast he said them 18s uh i mean those 17s is they ain't nobody gonna buy them because ain't nobody got no feet that big but they pretty much stocked for retail they still got the tags on them and stuff like that hang tag intact of course you ain't getting no box with these guys these some stumper though they are huge last time they did a jordan retro in here it was the um the true blue jordan ones that they had in here and um i just undsed them by the way but he's so damn big man it, I, you, it's just it's crazy when you see stuff like this sometimes but i know they big sizes of course that's like an uncommon size somebody be walking around with a size 17 to 18 on but like i said some people's locations including this one had smaller sizes i heard some people said they had like size eight nine uh, and most people said 11 and up but those went real fast and you know the Stomper sizes was left over, and then they got them by the size 12s. It excited me at first. I saw the 12, I saw that 12 up there, and then I saw them. I was like, oh, they might have my size, but yeah, that's over with. Um, for what else they got? And since I'm in here, some Zions, I like I said, I didn't even know what none Zion other his shoes look like, but this one actually look it's cleaner than that new one. I, I, I want to say, I'm crazy about that strap, but it look more wearable than that new one. Um, I got a three though, Shaddy. Threes on deck, Shaddy. I almost, I got another Ross closer to my house. I almost want to hit that one up too, but I, that's more closer. You're going closer to the city with that one, and I know they probably definitely ain't going to have me now. I got some pennies in here. Huh? These pennies, feel like these pennies dropped not too long ago. These penny twos, they want $85 for these too. Most of the, if you see a retro, is usually they just stick to that $85 Ooh. price point. Man, somebody tired, but um, yeah, man. Pennies with the orange. Shatter backboard action. I hate penny too, but I don't like all the piled on top.
top bitch of the mid, so I don't be liking that. Bit. I don't know. Y'all want some pen too? This is a size 11 and a half right there for the 85. Yeah, got another pair of them pennies up there. Um, got some Air Max down here. Some Air Max action going on. What the price is? He's sixty four dollars for the Air Max. Got some more of them pennies right there. That's three pairs of pennies in here. Um, I got some Aunt Bears number. Um, Air More Tempos, kind of like a brown colorway, brown and got some cream tan action. Like that recycled looking bottom with all them little specks in it and all like that. These are size, I don't know, hold on, nine and a half for $79. But honestly, that's kind of, it's kind of steep for Ross for a shoe to be $79. They starting to catch on to what they got in here. These Nike, I forgot the name of these. They came out back in the day. This is a super ugly colorway of these. But he's $59. This thing's starting to chirp. Finna put it back. It's like, put me down. So, I put it down. Is them some Grand Hills up there? <laughs> they are. <laughs> they got some Volt. Well, it look yellow on this camera, but it's kind of like this Volt color on these Grand Hills. $24. So, they know. <laughs> they, they they pretty much know they, they lane with the Grand Hills. I think every, that's more like a Ross price right there. $24. Yeah, every shoe should be like twenty a $25 shoe in here. Bro, I went from wondering if they were gonna have them threes and head all to being mad that they ain't got my size in them. <laughs> That's more of them MX. But he K Swig, boy. K Swig game. They look like some that uh that New Balance will make. Or ASICs or something like that. I don't know. That's some Adidas forms. Size 10. How much? 39. $39. See, that's a Ross price too, man. Lavinces dot mid so some suede going on. He's talking about forum guy. He's talking about right, the Roshi run action going on. Thirty-seven dollars. Here did you say? You feed me. And there's one pair uh, uh, up tempos, and there's another pair up tempos, and another pair of those MX in a different colorway. They had a red one too. I saw. Keep looking, thinking I'm gonna find one of them. Uh, one of them threes and a hiding somewhere. But oh, that's what they got. The two ant bears. Oh, Anyway, we know what the three look like, but still, one more look at these planks, titanic stumples <laughs> before we leave. Uh, you know, it's always something something to look at and something to, you know, talk about when you see retros, regardless of what size it is. And uh, especially a popular retro like this. Like, this shoe was popular, sold out. Everybody liked the shoe. Everybody, a lot of people copped it, especially sneakerhead. So, it's always some, it's sneaker news. You know what I'm saying? So I have to report on it coming to you live from Ross Dress for Legs. He talking about one more look at the three. What are these? Oh, fly. Together we fly. Oh, okay then. Oh, okay. Before I leave, I was walking over here in the women's section just to see if somebody put somebody out of place. And you got these, ain't these the uh, LeBron joints right here? Somebody said, what is it? Is it the LeBron? I can't remember. I have to look them up, but it's like something like the LeBron something Air Force One. $65, good quality. I've seen these at the outlets. Oh, this is a six and a half, but it's still a men's. That's probably why they put them over here because they stay so small. This don't even look like on six and a half. That's how you know Air Force Ones are some stompers, boy, because these things look like a size eight at least, boy. Air Force Ones, yeah, big, bro. This six and a half look bigger here. They got these tied tight together, boy. Yeah, sign me twin shoe ass. Hey, you talking about? Anyway, uh, just want to talk short over before I left. I can't, I never can remember. And every time I say, I look at these shoes and I'm in the outlet and stuff like that. People always comment what they is and I can never remember. So y'all ain't even got to comment it. I figure it out by the time uh, I edit the video. Uh -uh. There's no place like home shoe at. Hey, you know what? Goddamn Balenci hell no. Oh, Skechuk, I mean, hell no. No, we not. Come on, y'all. Come on. So the designer wave is influential. Okay. Ow. Them, them hurt. Them really hurt my foot just then. Uh, <laughs> the designer wave is influential because Steve Madden getting in on the uh, the Balenciaga slash Yeezy Dad shoe. What happened to that? Is that still a trend? People still talking about them. People still trying to get them. But look at these Grand Hill with the patent leather, boy. They're going crazy with the Grand Hills in here. USA looking guy. You know what I'm talking about? Patriotic shoe. But look at that shattered bat boy leather on these boots, boy. Buttery. Easy. I'm gonna take a shot in the dark. I know this is just probably slim pickings, but this is the one that's closer 
to where I live, a little closer to the city, with a more urban, y'all know what I'm saying, more of us, our cousins out here, you feel me? <laughs> and I just, I, I, I had to stop here just because I seen them at the other place. I had to come to this one too. I was gonna say like, usually this one don't have nothing. They have way less shoes. So with that being said, like if this part of the video might not make the, make the cut, if they ain't got these guys in here, you feel me? And already, I can tell that they ain't got them in here. I got the, I got the vibe. I got the feeling that they ain't got them in here. They got some, <laughs> they got some does zero though. Some does zero action. They look like my size. It's a thirteen. What y'all think the price gonna be? Before we flip it, I'ma guess that these are eighty-five dollars. Just cause they got jump man on them. Nope, sixty-nine. See, that much they should call retail in the store. <laughs> I know a lot of people like Dove Zero, so I'm gonna get off on. But it's like the fire red Dove Zero colorway. I just wear like patent leather from 11s, like the upper from like 13s, all a little different. Jordan's laser etched in them, got the six spoiler. They got the, like, and it's the, like Jordan 18 or 20 or 16 or something like that. That that uh, Jordan logo? Uh uh. Just can't do them, Charter. Can't do it. Boy. These are some, but what's that album cover that Michael Jackson had, bro, with the lions and the, but I can't think of it. Got, it got the uh, song, um, <sighs> Black or White. It got Black or White on it. That don't, the album with Black or White, this is the Michael Jackson album cover, Black or White. Black is white. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. He talking about boy. Majestic um, safari shoe, Michael Jackson guy. So you have black Air Force Ones, and you also got them black Echo guys. Boy, what type of time you got to be on, Charlie? These them fry cook boy. These them cut the lettuce boys, boy. Dishwasher shoe, Echo guy. What's the price? It's a size twelve two. Why I got to be my my side? Then they twenty dollar. Boy, don't play with them, boy. What type of time you on? Creep late at night. Run up on you at the, at the uh, ATM machine with these boys. <laughs> Not the NMDs. Not for sixty dollars. No. Y'all remember that trend? Y'all remember the NMDs? Like was selling out a few years. Well, it's been a minute now. It's been like what, 2016 or something like that. 2017, 15. You couldn't even find an NMD in the store. Now they at their rightful home. Uh, <laughs> And I ain't gonna cap them, cause y'all will probably go back to the tape. I actually did try a couple of NMDs out back in the day, so you know what I'm saying. You know, I was trying to trying to check out what everybody was talking about. Uh, shout out to the Rock, cause he got to be his shoe. He under arm, I know that, but he buddy high tail boot. If you from the '90s and you remember high tail boots, comment below, cause that what he look like. <laughs> Military boot shoe. Some more NMDs with the extra laces on them. You feel me for the fifty nine dollars. They go another pill. You play I Spy with the NMD, but you gonna find a lot of them. So if this, I'm like from what I'm hearing, almost every Ross got allocated pairs of those um threes. I don't know if it was a, I don't know what the reason it was for them to get them. I mean, I know them big sizes they always go to places like that, but they got some smaller sizes too. And I don't like I said, they don't look like B grades, but I'm almost a hundred percent sure that they did have them in here at some point. But like I said, this is closer to the area where people will actually know about stuff like that or hear about it you know what i'm saying because they got the pennies in here too but um i'm pretty sure if they did have them in here i don't care what size it was somebody with some big um mountain man feet probably came in here and got them so yeah there's that they ain't playing with the nmd but they need to put these guys on on a, a extra discount they want to get rid of them they got a lot i to get up out of here now i want to go to ross's all around the city it's too late i ain't even do all that night but I want to go to Ross's all around the city and see if he can get lucky, man. You know what I'm saying? Scavenger hunt. Yeah, man. So we back at the crib. And it's real. But it ain't. It, it, I can't find my size. I pretty much knew it was going to be stomper yacht sizes. You know what I'm saying? I know it was going to be like um, 17s, 18s, stuff like that. Um... But I don't know, man. I started to go. I started to go to another Ross, but it's, it's getting real late. So these things. Well, actually, they stay up to midnight. So I, I still could have went to a few Rosses, but uh, I might say that for another day, man. And only record if I like. I said if I find a gym size like an eight, nine, ten, or eleven, twelve, my size, then I probably just grab them just to like 
I mean, they eighty five dollars. You know what I'm saying? You, you you can do something with that shoe, whether trade it, sell it. You know what I'm saying? Keep it for a rainy day or something like that. You can do something with that shoe. You know what I'm saying? So comment below if y'all local area Ross dress for less got the uh, Air Jordan three uh, reimagined things. They looking cleansed in my humble opinion. I only have one pair, and I had two of them, but I was like, man. I got free throw line threes and no reason to really double up on that shoe and unless I catch them at Ross for $85. You feel me? So anyway, y'all comment below. If y'all like this video, hit the thumbs up, like this video, subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. Hit that notification bell so you can become a part of Rich Nation. Stand all the way up to the moon on them and keep watching my video because that's what I'm here for. Gone. Watch me so stupid the Dara. Check out my kiss in apparel. Rich like a king of fairy, yeah. Yeah, air capitan, they callin' me jet like I'm sparrow. East Atlanta in my blood, the streets got me twin like Tia to Mary, yeah. Watch out with the Camaro. Stay out my lane, it's too narrow. God more, God more, stay and bless, I'm keeping my eye on the sparrow. Man of the people you did, they singin' my name just like it's a carrot. Cause my got the juice by the barrel.